In this video, we're going to be talking about Jezebel. I was called a Jezebel. So, by Lily. So, we're going to talk about what a Jezebel is and whether or not she should repent and seek the kingdom because the kingdom is not in her at this moment. Okay? A Jezebel was the chaste daughter of F. Baal. 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 The king of the Zidonians. And the wife of Ahab, the king of Israel. This was the first time that the king of Israel had allied himself by marriage with a heathen princess, and their alliance was in the case of particularly distressed kind. Jezebel has stamped her name on the history as representative of all that is designing, crafty, malicious, revengeful, and cruel. Okay? What is a Jezebel? What is a Jezebel? A Jezebel is someone who teach you, teaches you to eat sac things sacrificed unto idols, teaches you um, masturbation, teaches you to have sex and adulterous, teaches you not to follow the commandments, laws, and Sabbath. That's what a Jezebel is, right? That's what a Jezebel is, correct? Let me show you something. Let's redo that. so many videos okay so I made a video telling people don't masturbate don't have sex don't lie don't steal don't kill don't be gay sexual repent repent a Jezebel will tell you to do every one of these things A Jezebel will tell you not to follow the commandments that Christ gave you. A Jezebel doesn't care about anything other than herself. That's what a Jezebel does. She turns everybody around her into adulterous whores. Yahoo is not your first love, you're going to go to hell. Period. If you don't believe in the will of the Father, which is to trust and have faith and believe in the Son that He sent here, you're going to go to hell. Period. See, a Jezebel doesn't teach abstinence and all of these different things. Yeah. If you say, I'm a Jezebel, then you don't know me. And you pass misjudgment. I am the original daughter of Zion. I am Mary Magdalene. Baby, you should repent before you see hell. Lee, Lee. And let's go to your comments, shall we? Because we've answered pretty much all of your comments, right? Oh, I didn't even see that yet. Okay. She called me a Jezebel. Because I didn't use any scriptures. Is that a reason to become a Jezebel? I don't think so. I don't have to use any scriptures because I know the scriptures by heart. So what I'm saying is the truth because my father is speaking to me. Just because Yahuwah doesn't speak to you, then you're listening to Satan. 
I'm not a Christian. I'm a Hebrew Israelite. I'm from the tribe of Judah, a real Jew. So, you call me a Jezebel because I made a video about Yahuwah is the strength of my heart. Wow. Because we're warriors. Let's see what you do on the day of Yahuwah when it's time to fight the dragon. Well, let's see if you fall. Let's see if you get brutally murdered. See, I'm going to be fighting along the side of the general. What about you? Have you been given your position? Really? 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 I'm a Jezebel, but I teach people not to fornicate. What does Jezebel mean? What doctrine am I teaching? A false prophet is somebody who teaches a doctrine other than repentance, other than a way through Christ. Yeah, I don't think you watch my videos. I think you hate me. But I just tell you, Yahushua said all those who hate Mary Magdalene is going to the fire. So, I guess you won't make it to the kingdom after all if you don't repent. Turn away from your evil ways, Lee Lee. Why don't you cook? I live in a hotel. You got a stove for me? You you got you got money that you could you could pay for us to walk around with stoves and refrigerators and microwaves every day while we're trying to pay for our room. We eat. We're vegetarians. We eat out. When we do eat in, it's because we have the money to eat in. But not all the time can somebody get a Walmart gift card um, to be able to go to Walmart. You have to go where you can eat at. But I forgot. You got everything handed to you, don't you? You got a place? You could just go in the kitchen, huh, and just cook you something to eat. Well, I live in a hotel. You live in a hotel? Do you have the extra $20? It's going to be like $100 a night. You got an extra $20 for me and my children every night? Since you want to talk about cooking, you got extra $20 for hotel? Cough it up if you got it. Since you got so much to complain in your mouth. I just love you. You have a blessed and wonderful day, Lily. And may Yahuwah open up your eyes and you repent before you burn in hell.